Hello everybody, welcome to my second vlog. I would like to thank everybody who watched my vlog last week, everybody who gave me positive feedback and especially everybody who shared my vlog. Uh, they say sharing is caring, so I really appreciate it. I appreciate all the love. Uh, one of the questions I got a lot this week is why I'm making this vlog in English and not in Dutch. Uh, but the main reason is that I have a lot of friends abroad who I met through traveling who don't speak Dutch and I really know that they're watching as well. So a big shout out to all my foreign friends. And the second reason is that I will do an internship in Barcelona next semester. And I know I will meet people there who are going to want to watch my vlog as well. So that's the second reason. I really hope that my Dutch followers don't really mind that I speak English. Um, if you have any more questions, please do in the comment section below. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. Uh, in the end of the video, I will give you some insights and some tips that I found out uh, for promoting your vlog or promoting any content that you make. So please stick till the end and let's go! just came back from a meeting with Mark Kuhne, who is the head of trainee here at Pixel for uh, journalism. Um, we, sat down, we sat down with him to see which type of media partners we can enroll in for our campaign. And thanks to his expertise, we have a pretty good grasp of which medias are possible and which aren't. Yeah, it was a nice experience to sit, sit with uh, an expert in the field, actually. Wednesday, we just got back from the gym, heading to school. Today is going to be a busy day. I have school until 5, come home, eat something and then I will be leaving again because I will be photographer at Comedy Mania tonight. Again for the newspaper Belang van Limburg and also for the organization of Limbo Mania. Um, my photos, I have a deadline to edit my photos and that's 1 p.m. on Thursday. So, and I have some classes I have to attend in the morning on Thursday. So it's going to be an all-nighter as well to edit my pictures, I think. So it's 5 o'clock. I just came home from school and now I'm getting everything ready to go take pictures tonight at Comedy Mania and Tippenbeek. So I just arrived here in Diepenbeek at the block where I will be taking pictures tonight in this venue and the venue looks quite nice actually. And here is where starting comedians are trying to get some laughs, hopefully they will succeed. <laughs> here in Deep and Big is done. Uh, heading home now, it's almost 11 now. Will take me a couple of hours to edit, so I won't get much sleep. So it's Thursday morning. I got my editing done a bit quicker than I expected yesterday, which was a good thing. I got a bit more sleep than I expected. I'm still a bit tired, but you gotta love the grind. Today, French and English classes, and then we have to sit together with a group of my campaign with LTM Brecht to further our, our details keep you posted. Yeah. 
Corinne of luck. So it's Friday, I just came home from the gym, uh, had some lunch and now it's time to get some work done for school. I have a lot of assignments to finish. Uh, yesterday, Alec Bright and I sat together for our campaign for the cabinet of Suldemir because we had to do some changes because we have to work with another target audience than the campaign we proposed to them last year. We did some updates to the concept. We sent them a file with a new pitch today through email. I hope they like it. Then we can start contacting partners to uh, work with. I can't tell you much about the details of the campaign because it's still a bit secret. Uh, you probably just uh, hear from it at, uh, when it's enrolled and I think it will be the spring of 2018, maybe the summer. Uh, another thing, this morning I went to the get the newspaper because I'm in it again. Uh, as you can see. So I know it's only my second vlog and the second time I'm in the newspapers, but that isn't normally the case. <laughs> it was actually the, sec the two first times I was in the newspaper and I don't think I will, my pictures will be in the newspaper anytime soon. But still, I hope so. Saturday today I'm here at the kids climate conference at Center Park. Uh, school sent me here to help them out with the social media. I will support the social media team from here. So looking forward to this. I will make a lot of footage here today I hope so. So I just got my sweater so I'm officially one of the crew. I'm rocking around a bit to explore everything that's about to happen here today. So the workshop just started here for all the kids and I'm going around to take some pictures to post on the social media later on. I will be doing the Instagram. All of today is that the kids are getting workshops about the durability. The main theme here today is food and all the kids are doing workshops. I will show you a bit what they are doing. So that is the site here, it's a nice atmosphere. So I'm done here for today, it was a long day, I've been here for almost 11 hours, uh, it was a nice experience to work with the uh, center parks to, and the organization of the Kids Climate Conference, uh, it was a nice experience to see how we can do some event, social media posts, it was a bit hard, it was rainy, it was cold, uh, we didn't have Wi-Fi which is hard if you are in charge of the social media but so we managed to get some uh, messages out into the world uh, and we started just today with an Instagram account which wasn't a good idea I think because the reach wasn't that high but still we managed to get some messages out there as well so all in all good day So that was it for this week, I hope you liked it. Like I said in the beginning of the video, I will give you some quick uh, tips and insights uh, from what I found out of promoting my vlog. Uh, I don't want to tell you all the obvious things, but I'm not going to give you some advanced tips either. 
because I'm still a beginning vlogger. Uh, I haven't found out everything myself yet, but when I do, I will share it with you as well. Because in the beginning of the video, I said sharing is caring, so I would well, like to share all the knowledge with you as well. Uh, what, we want, what I want to talk to you about is Bitly. Bitly is a link shortener, but you can also use it to track your clicks. That's how I found out that a lot of my foreign friends are watching, because when you make a shorter link with Bitly, you can also track uh, from which platform they clicked on it, from which uh, country they clicked on it, which date, which hour. So it's a very powerful tool. Uh, the second thing that I found out was that LinkedIn is a very powerful um, platform to promote uh, your content. Uh, because uh, I've made a small video on LinkedIn and video is very new on LinkedIn so it's higher in the news feeds as well but also it lasted for three days three days after I posted my message to promote my vlog people were still clicking from LinkedIn and uh, also they were still liking it so and the last thing I want to talk to you about is the repurposing of content uh, last week I had a part at the end of my vlog where I gave my insights as, as a vlogger the, my first week vlogging uh, I made some cutouts out of that content and made a small video for Instagram uh, because people on Instagram like that kind of content as well because I had a lot of views on it and I got a lot of new followers from it and also people clicking to my vlog so repurposing content for other platforms is a really good idea uh, and think about it as well if you want to see it in the description there is a link to my Instagram post I probably would be doing the same thing with this uh, part of my vlog so I see you next week if you haven't subscribed yet please do uh, if you have any more questions any more tips uh, any more feedback there is a comment section below here you can ask me on Facebook everywhere please do uh, and I will see you next week